strategies for enhancement in food production animal husbandry it is a branch of agriculture which deals with systematic practice of breeding and raising livestock by applying scientific principles it includes care and breeding of livestock like buffaloes cows pigs horses cattle sheep camels goats bees silkworms lac insects etc along with poultry farming and fisheries it is to be noted that the term livestock here refers to domesticated animals of different breed kept in an agricultural land for the benefit of human beings whereas fisheries include rearing of fish and other aquatic animals humans rear animals for various products like milk eggs meat wool silk honey etc more than 70% of the world livestock population is in india and china however their contribution to the world farm produce is mere 25% thus we can infer that the productivity per unit livestock is very low compared to other countries therefore the application of new technologies is very important to achieve improvement in quality and productivity animal breeding one of the important aspects of animal husbandry is animal breeding here animals with very good genetic traits are selectively mated together in order to improve the quality of the future generations the chief objectives of animal breeding are increased quality and quantity of yield like milk eggs meat and wool higher growth rate of farm animals better assimilation efficiency of reared animals strong resistance to various diseases longer productive life higher acceptable reproductive rate animal breeding is broadly classified into two types in breeding and out breeding in breeding we have learnt that the first generation of cross breed hybrid will have recessive allele in their genome so in order to have pure hybrid with no recessive alleles in it in breeding is performed in in breeding very closely related animals generally brothers cousins etc are mated with each other in each generation the animals that express recessive or harmful character are eliminated and the remaining are bred again after repeated inbreeding and selective selection pure lines of hybrids with no recessive characters are obtained however there is problem with inbreeding when the pure breeds are repeatedly inbred after few generations some of the dominant characters lose their effectiveness this is also called inbreeding depression to overcome this inbreeding depression outcrossing is performed outbreeding outbreeding is a technique in which breeding is done between unrelated animals here the term unrelated refers to the animals of either same breed having different ancestors or animals of different breeds or different species outbreeding is generally carried out by three ways these are outcrossing crossbreeding and interspecific hybridization outcrossing in this method of breeding mating of animals is allowed within the same breed here the animals are selected in such a way that both the animals do not have common ancestry for at least 6 generations by doing this inbreeding depression can be overcome outcrossing infuses vigor and vitality in the offspring due to this outcrossing of pure animals is preferred over impure animals crossbreeding in crossbreeding two animals of different breeds but of same species are mated together the offspring produced will have dominant characters of both animals crossbreeding is done to develop new superior breeds and also to improve the quality of local breeds 
the hybrids thus obtained have more commercial value. For example, when indigenous cow breed Tarpakar having properties like high disease resistance and low milk yield is mated with an exotic breed Holstein having properties like low disease resistance and very high milk yield. A special hybrid was formed called Karen Fries. This cow was both disease resistant and had high milk yielding capacity. In the first generation, there will still be some recessive characters. So, the hybrid is subjected to inbreeding and selection to develop a stable hybrid. Here are some examples of cattle crossbreeds. Several factors are considered before selecting cattle for crossbreeding. Some of these are as follows. Quality of breed and its yield value. Diet requirement of the breed. Ratio of yield to diet. Reproductive maturity of the breed. Duration of reproductive period. Lactation. Mammary system. Size of udder. Nature of the breed. Disease resistance. Acclimatization. Vigor and vitality. Capacity to work. Crossbreeding is also done to sheep. High Sedale, sheep, developed in Punjab by crossing Bikaneri Eves and Merino Rams. Crossbreeding is also done to improve the poultry breeds. Here the best egg layers and broilers are allowed to crossbreed by a method called pen mating. In this method, one male is kept with 10 to 15 females in rooms called pens and allowed to mate. Here are some of the examples of poultry cross breeds. Interspecific hybridization Interspecific hybridization involves mating of male and female of two different species. The offsprings has desires characters of both the species. For example, when male donkey is mated with female horse, the offspring is called mule. Mule can survive in harsh environments and are capable of doing hard labor. Due to this, they are considered as good beasts of burden. Here are a few examples of interspecific hybridization. There is one big problem with interspecific hybridization. That is, the hybrids are sterile. However, due to their high economic benefits, they were bred regularly.